Yes. Uh, for, for young kids like you. So yeah, later. <laughs> later. There's a boy talking about jumping on the trampoline. A bird's death. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So, like, uh, because of all the presence of dinosaurs in Tanzania, at least the remains, what the government really wanted to is create the something that will create awareness uh, for the presence of dinosaurs. So this one is just was created during the recycle project. As you can see, used a lot of metals that are thrown away, padlocks and everything. And it was also created by one person. I mean, this project is very huge. If you walk around the roundabouts in Tanzania, you'll see some like turtles also made out of iron, everything else. So it's a project that was aimed at, at recycling, but also creating something very unique and interesting like this one. So we have five different species of dinosaurs that are found in Tanzania, but this one was decided to create a T-Rex, which is the most well-known, I think, dinosaur species of all. Tinosaurus rex. Unique. So you can see those things made out of different, different materials, like bicycle parts. So, but in the region that uh, the dinosaurs are found, which is in the southern part of Tanzania, known as Lindi, we have the over five different of them, different like these statues in different parts of the city. So, there are over like approximately 5,000 square kilometers is conserved because that's where we find a lot of species of dinosaurs every year. So, every year we find different places, and you can actually go there and see all where the remains were found. It's particularly very interesting, but it's very far away from here. I just have to warn you, just in case I go take it. You are the man. You are the man. This would be a good place for a group picture. Yes. So this is the icon of the museum. The oldest building. Is this there? Open. The, the picture is not good? No, I was just saying uh, the sun is maybe the only on the eye. aspect. So like, uh, if you can... Wait, let's wait for the others to be here. Let's give them a few. But this one is the... If you look at even the Google, the museum, the oh, National Museum. They, they're taking their time. We're doing our own. Uh, so should we continue? Yeah, hold us up. yeah, this is go on do, do your flow. Do your flow. We have to keep up as yeah. we mentioned yeah. earlier. Yeah, so what I was trying to say, like first if you can look at it, the design is mostly Arabic. Yes. It's yeah. because like the culture he has always been under the influence of the Arabic culture since the twelfth century. Through trade, uh, particularly through trade and, and also intermediate marriage interaction. That's what you can see the design is always Arabic. But also ninety percent of everything here has not changed. The same since nineteen forty. We have door, Zanzibar. Exactly the same as Zanzibar too. Mostly because of the culture that they say. Right. The culture that I say, the Arabic culture, so they share a lot of things. Right. So that's why they decided to make these doors. Even the windows, you can see the, the structure. So only minor, very, very minor things are being done to repair this one. Especially in the inside. But right now we are removing, the, we are exchanging exhibitions. So that's what was closed and we can't go inside. But you can try the door first. Right. You can like, you know, I want to make sure I heard that right. We can't go inside? Yeah, you can't go inside. You can see it's closed because we are changing exhibitions inside. So, but otherwise, we would have gone and see the texture and the design of the, of the building. Uh, uh, excellent. I got, have a quick question. Yes. Uh, we're in Arusha, and it was the same situation. Where? Uh, Arusha. Uh, whether it's uh, the natural museum or whether yes. it was the uh, decoration museum. It seems a lot of things are being upgraded as far as exhibitions. So, which, so so like we, had a, we had a huge influx of tourists, especially during the corona period. Right. So one among the very few countries which can actually say so. So we had a lot of things that we found out that uh, are not up to standard. Especially in this building, it was like water were leaking. So we had to fix that. We had also exhibitions that were here for 40 years. We had to fix that too. We have to change. We have a lot of things in storage. So that's the only thing that happens all across the museum. 
So the, as Arusha Decoration Museum is also under the National Museum. So that's the progress, like the process, project of all the museum branches. In terms that's of. beautiful. So in a few years, we see growth. Just like when we were in uh, Z on Zanzibar Island in yes. Stone Town, yes. uh, House of Wonders and a few different uh, places were still under renovation. So it seemed like the whole country is looking to take their museums and take the history of the country to another level where it's updated, uh, renovated. That's, that's the aim of all the government. So I just wanted to explain that to our viewers that, that are listening. That way they can clearly understand uh, it's a situation of being upgraded to where we can have a better, you know, be better view of uh, the presentation. Because I guess you guys are looking to see more people come to Tanzania and you want to make sure you have the best museum for them. Yes, sure. And uh, guys, sorry, before you go, can we have like a good a group picture right here? Oh, perfect. Group sorry, picture! So, I think I, so this is the icon of the museum, the only place you can say you're visiting the National Museum? Yeah. It's good, it's good. Please, please. Oh. Do you have your attention? Oh.